Will drinking yerba mate actually increase your risk of esophageal cancer? Well, according to actual research and not the dumpster fire of bad science that is the IR, drinking very hot yerba mate or drinking smoked varieties of yerba mate or drinking commercially prepared yerba mate that is industrially dried, exposed to smoke, or prepared improperly will likely increase your risk of esophageal cancer because of either damaging the cells of the esophagus due to the hot temperature or because the smoked or commercial preparation of the product caused the presence of polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons like benzoapyrene the same carcinogen found in cigarette smoke. This mechanistic data goes along with the best outcome epidemiological data that we can obtain regarding cancer risk, such as this meta-analysis, which found that increased consumption of yerba mate is associated with the development of esophageal cancer at higher and higher rates. To be specific, your odds of being diagnosed with esophageal cancer will be two and a half times higher drinking yerba mate, and based on the mechanism by which esophageal cancer occurs due to yerba mate, these increased odds are due to either consuming yerba mate at high temperatures or the presence of carcinogens like polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons carbons directly in the drink. So am I telling you to avoid all yerba mate altogether? No. Just try to avoid or limit commercially prepared and smoked yerba mate as the preparation may confer a higher risk product. Do your best to make yerba mate at home, emphasizing the methods from these studies that found little to no polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons in the final product.